say hi, Ellie. Can, did you see her? Maybe, I don't know. All right, so my name's Kylie. I am walking my dog to uh, show how legitimate this is. I have no papers around me. I'm occupied walking my dog, being subconscious about while talking about random lines to people on streets. I'm fairly awesome in that way. So uh, I have to recite 10 lines for a class. Uh, like if the government or whatnot had uh, wiped out all documentation, whatever, what I what I would want to remember and whatnot, I, I don't know. But uh, this is from a passage from a book called the, the Door Within that I really, really like. It's about knights and stuff. And uh, I really, I really like the book. And uh, this certain passage I'm gonna say meant a lot to me when I first read it. So uh, I, th I thought, I th and it has, a, it has a good lesson to me. So I, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and you know recite this one. It's important to me. But anyway, so uh, my second time trying to say the lines. I was messing up the first time. Memorization isn't my forte. So, uh, so here we go. The Paragar Knight who had pushed Aiden sneered, shook his head with disdain, and announced, How weak you are. Do not the parents of your world teach you how to wield a blade? Stand and fight, you gutless coward. Aiden had heard enough, so he did stand. After wiping the blood from his chin, he drew so furin from its scabbard, the sword made an echoing metallic ring as it came loose. He held it menacingly towards the paragon. No. He held it menacingly with the razor sharp tip pointed towards the paragon knight. The paragon knight stood not five feet from the edge of Aiden's sword. He hadn't expected Aiden to actually do anything. The fierce look in Aiden's eye and the powerful looking sword had him worried. But he drew his own blade. He couldn't back down in front of everyone. Come, come on then, the Paragon Knight challenged. Do your worst. As the Paragon Knight continued to provoke Aiden, Aiden stepped forward and did something remarkable. With both his hands, he grasped the Son of Fury and laid it at the feet of the young, taunting knight. I offer you my sword, he announced, as a sign of peace, for the kingdom of Aabel is a kingdom of peace. And th those are the lines. I had to edit it because it was a bit longer, but yeah, that one's my favorite. So anyway, I'll probably delete this video after teacher says he saw it. So, adios. Signing out, peeps. Say bye, Ellie. You're just focused on walking. All right, bye.